Hello everyone, Video James here, and welcome back to some Destiny. Uh, before we start today's video, I want to just discuss where I've been right now, because I was uploading a Division Let's Play series, and then I uploaded a video saying I was sick, and I stopped from there. I was like, <clears throat> excuse me, so I'll just explain what happened. So, immediately when I was done recording that video, that, that night, I got sick again. I got another freaking head cold, even after I was feeling better, after the first one. And then eventually, when I that one lasted like about three days. And then when I was done dealing with that one, I got my sister sick. <laughs> so, and seeing as though my parents were busy with work, and you know, and she had her school stuff, I had to take care of her, like, make sure she had her right medicine. She actually ended up getting a fever while she had it too. So I've been being a little doctor. So, uh, I didn't really have a lot of time to edit and record on top of all my stuff for school. And seeing as though I have two tests in a row tomorrow. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. That's where I've been recently. I've just been dealing with my family and other personal stuff and whatnot. So, yeah. But now I'm back, and I'm coming back on a perfect note. And by the way, um, uh, I will be restarting... Well, not restarting, but I will be bringing back the Division Let's Play series because I still have a couple episodes pre-recorded that I could upload, and I'm going to record more, obviously. And there was some new content that came out with this update right here, this beautiful and, in my opinion, even cooler update for Destiny. Uh, so, yeah, this is coming first on my list. The Division stuff I might cover. We'll see. But as of right now, we'll get into this Destiny stuff, and I actually have one friend with me. You guys might remember him from Crimson Days, but I'll bring him in here once I'm done going through the tower. But right here, as you can see, uh, and he's downloading his update anyway, so, but anyway. New patch, 2.20. Visit the reef to begin. So, let's go over the details if you don't already know. So, the max light... Max light is raised. So originally your max light was 220, uh, 320, I apologize, and now it is going to be 335. So there are new challenges in the world that demand you that demand you become stronger to face them. Gear is now dropping at higher light levels. Next up, Prison of Elders. Face the taken in a level 41 version of Prison of Elders. Challenge of the Elders who waits for the greatest guardians. Challenge of the Elders is kind of like a PvE version of Trials, I guess you can say. That's kind of what it is. Loot and infusion. This is a good part. New gear, weapons, and sparrows have been added to the high level activities. Infusion now upgrades gear to the light level of the consumed item. So essentially, with all these crazy new chroma armor pieces and these taken armor pieces, they all drop at three defense, which is not good for Destiny. So now, if you have, let's say, a raid piece, like a raid helmet, and you have a chroma helmet that you got, and it's at three defense, but your raid helmet is at 310. If you infuse the raid helmet into the chroma helmet, then it'll immediately become 310. There's no piece by piece infusion anymore. It is direct infusion and it is beautiful. And that is amazing. <laughs> and that goes for everything. That doesn't just go for the, uh, for the vanity items and stuff like that, which is what I guess they're calling them. The only reason why I say that is because of this last section. New vanity items. Eververse expands into the reef and refreshes its stock. Discover new emotes, sterling treasures, and chroma gear. I was t That's the chroma gear, obviously, and you obviously have your taking gear, and then the new there's new emotes and stuff like that, which I might eventually buy. I'm kind of low on silver, but, uh, you know. Now, these sterling treasures can be earned. You can earn three of them in a week. One of them is just given to you from the Postmaster, the other one is given from you if you complete a weekly Crucible event, and then the other one is given to you from Varix if you do the Prison of Elders for one time during the week. So yeah, that is the new content. Oh yeah, also, uh, take a minute to like just enjoy my new ship, the new future Workhole ship. It's not the new one, but you know, it's cool. So, as you can see here, I have two things in my Postmaster. I, I'm going to be honest, I don't remember if those are like... Uh, the uh, old ones that I had, like if, if it was anything old that I just didn't look at. Also, another thing I might want to mention, the Nightfall has been bumped. It is now a 320 recommended activity. So currently in my state, I could attempt it and I think I'd do okay. And especially if I had like some of the stuff, but right now the light level has been raised and it is now recommended 320. So also, yeah, no, nothing new has changed here. There's, these are just my old quests and stuff. And then obviously we have stuff in the reef. 
And here you go. This is the new Prison of Elders. This is a beautiful, beautiful thing. So look at this. This is a recommended light 260. That is extremely low for people who play the Taken King a lot or any of this new content. And this does not run on a weekly reset and you could get rewards every time you do it. It does not matter. Uh, like there's no treasure keys required to open the end chest. It's 260 light. You can do it as many times as you want during the week and you'll still get rewards. And you can get rewards up to 320. So you can like get rewards that will bring you to um, the light level recommend for the Nightfall and the Challenge of Eldest. So as you can see here, this is your recommended light 320 activity. You need a special pass from Varix in order to enter into this. And it, the way it works is like it, it's like an accumulative score between you and your fire team. If you get three like thirty thousand points, you'll be able to get like a piece of armor from him that'll drop at high level of 335 possibly and then if you get 9,000 altogether like if you get 30,000 in your personal score and 90,000 altogether as a fire team you can get a weapon and a piece of armor hopefully dropping at 335 and obviously exotics and legendaries are now dropping at higher levels than whatever you have which is amazing but for now we're gonna head on over to the reef in the Vestian outpost and we're going to check out what's new so Every week, like I said, they will give you a free sterling treasure just for doing nothing. Just for logging in for the week, you'll get one, which is awesome. And now these sterling treasures can hold new emotes, new uh, new pieces of armor, new ships, new... Um, what else do they have? New sparrows, vanguard and crucible reputation buffs, so you can get more reputation from those... Uh, from those like uh, those reputation gangers and whatnot. And also, I have this in my inventory. I wanted to bring this in here because uh, I just want to remember what this weapon feels like a little bit. This is the Badger CCL. This is a year one Vanguard weapon that was introduced back in the Dark Below. Uh, I, you can't see it, but I mean, yeah. If you're, you should be very familiar with it. It's a very familiar weapon. And now, not only did they bring back year one exotics such as the Patience in Time or the Lord of Wolves or the Universal Remote, or uh, the feedback fences, which are, which are my favorite, and I'm definitely gonna be picking those up as soon as I can. But they brought back old year one legendaries, Shadow Price, LDR, Badger CCL, Two to the Morgue, The Comedian, uh, Zombie Apocalypse, those ones, and it's super, super cool. So we're gonna take a look here. Oh, also, uh, they added a little Everest kiosk here in the reef. So let's take a look at the Postmaster first. And as we Shall can see here, message? oh, it looks like it's only other things. Interesting. So, um, okay, I don't know where our sterling treasure is going to be. I've heard, like, mixed reports of people not being able to get them, but I'm not sure. But we'll, we'll figure it out eventually. I, like, I don't think, yeah, no, it's not in my inventory right now. So, all right, yeah, we'll see where we can find it. But as you can see here, this is, uh... Yes, this is the new emotes and stuff. We could take a look. Club dance. <laughs> yeah, this is uh, this is this is one of the new emotes. We also have instructional dance. <laughs> I swear to God, they nail it with some of these. That is that is amazing. I love this game. This one. Here we go. Come on, everyone's got to know what this is. If you don't know what this is, you don't know the internet. <laughs> this is Shia LaBeouf's Just Do It motivational speak. And that runs on a loop, too. That's really funny. And the kickstance, I have no idea what this is from. I saw this in the preview stream. And I have no idea what this is from. It's really, it, That's, like, easily the weirdest one. And then we, we, all, we have all these other ones. Praise the gun. That's a good one. I like that. <laughs> Uh, we have Amazed, Mind Blown. <laughs> That's amazing. And then uh, you have Sumo. <laughs> Whoa. That's actually, That's actually a lot cooler than I thought it would be. And we have Bye Bye. Bye Bye. <laughs> and then we have Praise the Light. It's like a ritual thing, I guess you could say. I could see people getting in a circle in social spaces and just, nah. Eh, I don't know. Why are you asking me? 
And then we have the cr the crane kick. Oh, look at this. <laughs> I love that. And then we have the rude taunt. What the? Ah, <laughs> uh, it's like ha ha, can't get me. All right, yeah. Those those are all the new emotes, and uh, you obviously have all this stuff here still. And you also have this, the Taken Shiver. This is if you get every single piece of Taken armor, you can get this emote. And by God, is it frightening. <laughs> it's a shame that it only loops between three of them. Now, I want to point out my inventory right now for the Storyland Treasures, I believe, is full. So hold on, i got to clear it out. I assume there are new questions with the fall of Oryx. Alright, let's just uh, get rid of some of these engrams. None of these, I believe, are going to be dropping in anything that we should be concerned about. This is a th 282. These are actually just dropping a little bit higher, though. Look, look at that. 294 for a blue? That's crazy. And uh, over here, we have 273. That's okay. And then over here, we have 284. So, yeah. They're, they're dropping at higher uh, weapon levels, which is nice. Alright, so let me just get rid of this. And is there anything else in here that I can get rid of? Uh, I'm not getting rid of my raisins, that's for sure. Um, I'll get rid of the telemetries, because I don't use these. Okay. Alright, yeah, that's good. Um, so, if we go back to Eververse, real quick. Varix has a quest for us, I can see. Which is probably going to have to Im be involved with some of the new stuff. Uh, yep. Here we go. So, right here, I can buy one for 200, and I might as well. Boom. We're probably going to get a ton of them. Yeah, look, and it's just going to give me the notification again. I don't know, though, like, where you obtain your free one every week. I'm not sure. But let's just open the one that we have. It's got this cool little animation to it. Okay, so, looks like we got the chest piece and some red chroma. That's actually pretty cool. Let's take a look at this chest piece. Whoa, that's dope. That is awesome. And right now, it has yellow chroma on it. We don't have any yellow. So let's uh, do this. Like, if you don't like the color that's on it right now, you can make it so where you have the color that you want. Here we go. Red chroma. Boom. Look at that. Hold on. Boom. All right, hold on. Let's actually change my shader so that matches. Hold on. I think I have it. Yep. I got a red one in here. Whoa. All right, hold on. Actually, let me get the one that's got like a little bit of orange on it. That just makes me even more red. <laughs> That's cool. I will probably put that on once we, um, once I find some more stuff to infuse it into. Because as you can see right now, with that on, I'm on 283. But yeah, this chest piece is really cool. But for now, I'm just going to, you know, leave it at that. And I'll put on my other shader. So, there we go. That's better. Okay. Now, as far as your free sterling treasure... I have no idea where you get it now, because it's giving me a notification here that I can pick it up, but I, yeah, I, yeah, I just don't know. Now, just to show you what you can obtain, uh, this is some of the Taken armor. I'll show you the Taken helmet for the Titan. As you can see, it obviously gives off that Taken vibe. I don't think it matches with any shaders, so it's not going to be affected. So, yeah, and then you obviously have your hunter gear down here. It only gives you the desolate, like, um, you can get the specter, which I guess is what they call it. You can get the specter armor for any class on, um, in these sterling packages. But depending on what class you are, is it's specific to, uh, your, the taken armor. So, yeah. So, that's really, yeah, this is really cool stuff. I actually just, real quick, I want to check out this helmet, because this helmet is... Whew. That just screams Titan. That is awesome. Alright. And then obviously we have all these other cool stuff. We have marks and bonds and hoods. And we also have ships. This is probably the ship that everyone's going to want to want. Look at that. That is a taken ship. It is... Ugh. It is just beautiful. And then also we have... Uh, we also have the Space Age Mariner. Mariner. With, this is my old ship. This is like the uh, one that you got for doing the Black Spindle quest. But uh, if like if it's just white and has white finish. I originally thought that you were going to be able to put chroma on this, but you can't. Which is actually kind of a shame. Same thing with the Sparrow. Like, uh, for example, right here. S35 Aeon Glow. Like, look at that. That, lo that lo like, It looks like it was supposed to be meant to put 
uh, chroma on. But, eh, big deal. So, yeah. Now, uh, if you know where to get your free sterling treasure just for logging in, uh, please let me know. Because, as of right now, it's just giving me a notification. But let's go visit Varix. Hello, my old friend. You bested skull. All right, so complete the mission, Pretender to the Throne on the Dreadnought. Orcs is dead, but taken remain. No one voices control. No one, no one, no one voice controls them. Have heard, uh, hold on, let me do this in a Varric's voice. Have heard of one who hungers for power, wants to seize control for himself. Investigate, yes. <laughs> It's, I don't know if it's terrible, I don't know if it's good, God knows what. Uh, Alright, so and then we also have another one. Return to the prison. Prison cells are full, Guardian. Take hunger for light. Greater challenges, yes, but greater treasures for the worthy. So this is to complete a level 41 prison of elders. We got another one. Oh, judgment. Run. Boom. Okay. Oh, 20 healing infirmities. Thank you. Ooh! Ooh! New marks. The King's Mark. This is a Titan Mark. I am a King, uh, House of Kings fan. Ooh. Ooh, that looks nice. I like that. That's good. And you obviously have one for the Devils, and you have one, I believe, for the for the Wolves or the Winter. I'm not sure. The Wolves one looks nice if you're a fan of the House of Wolves. And obviously, this is, oh yeah, this is a Kells Mark, which means uh, this is probably, yep, this is a House of Wolves. No new ships. At least from what I'm seeing right now. And he also sells bounties. Might as well pick him up. This is, this is kill champions in level 41 prison of elders or challenge of elders. Kill enemies with precision shots in level 41 prison of elders or challenge of the elders. And then use heavy weapons to kill enemies in level 41 prison of elders or the challenge of elders. So, yeah. Oh, this is interesting. Um, so I could pick these up right now. But you need a legendary engram class specific. So you need a class-specific legendary engram in order to pick one of these up and 5,000 glimmer. That's interesting. And then here's your passage. I'm not going to pick this up until uh, until I'm Goodbye, ready for that. My friend. So, yeah. As far as your sterling treasure, I have no idea how to pick it up. It's, like, it, it's confusing, in a sense. I'm not sure. Unless it hasn't come to effect. And I don't know why it still has a mark over Everest, but I'm not sure. But that is everything, and obviously back at the tower, there's still stuff to do. You have uh, some of the new, uh, some of the new, whatchamacallit, it? you have some of the new, uh, all the uh, things that you can buy from the Vanguard and from the Crucible and from the factions, all weapons have different, uh, oh, come on, hold on a minute. Wait one minute. Get out of here. Ah. Uh this dude already has the Taken Sword. Oh my god. Alright, yeah, I might as well mention that now. You can get a Taken Sword now. The oh my god, let's take a look at this thing real quick. Sword Strike, temp oh wait, increases armor, oh right, yeah. Void Forge, use left trigger to guard, increases sword ammo capacity. This weapon deals bonus damage against Taken enemies. Okay, yeah, that's pretty good. Shout out to this dude for getting that so freaking early. That is amazing. 326 Black Spindle, that's awesome. But yeah, as I was saying, um, there's still tons of stuff down at the tower. Like, everything is going to start dropping now at higher levels. And some things will have new perk rolls, which is just awesome. But now I'm going to go grab my friend and we're going to go see what we can do. So I will be right back. And yeah, we'll see what we can, what we can do in this new world. Alright, so we're about to start up the quest. The main story quest, I guess you could say. Uh, I have Speed here. Speed Demon here with me. Speed, say hi. What's up? Hello. So, yeah, we're going to be probably, yeah, we're probably going to be doing most of this stuff together. Uh, so there will be multiple parts of all this spread off in the next couple days. So, uh, you want to start it up, Speed? Yeah, sure thing. All right, let's get her done. And uh, just a quick update. Uh, yeah, this is one of the new exotics that they added in. Uh, well, it's not a uh, year one exotic coming into year two. This was my favorite one, the feedback fences. So I had to pick these up for legendary marks. They're only at 296 because I infused them and stuff, but I just had to pick them up. That's I got infusion nice. gear, though. All right, let's listen. Oryx is dead. Taken. Unleashed. 
Many seek to claim the throne. I thought that killing Oryx would have ended the threat. Instead, we created a power vacuum. Hmm. <laughs> so who is this guy? This is Malak? Malak. Okay. Malak. Like yes. like the gra like the grasp of Malak. Yes. And the hood of Malak. And the hood of Malak. That's even yes. confirmed. That's what taken power strong here. That's what you little speed arises. demon wants to get. He hungers for Oryx's yes, power. I want that strike exclusive. Hungers One for Oryx's power. Was enough. Thank you. One taken king was enough. Yep, I agree. Let's go. They can't stop us. Oh my god, looks looks so beautiful. This dude's got like freaking. I don't know why you didn't here. you didn't get a sterling treasure. I mean I got one. Yeah, I think it's on my other character. I think your postmaster needs to be needs to be uh, empty. I'm not sure. I don't I'll figure it out. I don't think it'll be a problem either. Nice shade step. here we go. Oh behind us. Yep, shade step. Yeah. Kobe. Ooh. Come here. Oh, nice. My feedback fences even activate once the uh. No sign of a new Taken Prince yet. Once the uh the guys hit me with the with the close. shield blast. That's nice. He is close. Where is he? Oh, is that him? He's immune. Capture him, guardian. So it's pronounced Bring Malak. him to prison of elders. Bring him to the prison? You want him alive. Whatever happened to kill them back? <laughs> kill yeah. them back. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah, the ghost is funny. Where'd he go? Oh, he's over here. Ah, uh, get him! Summons more minions to his aid. So this is the oh boy. So this is the dude that wants to take over the throne? Yep. Interesting. He looks like he has a tumor on his head. Yeah, he looks like he has a tumor on his head. D don't worry, he'll he'll die of eventually brain cancer. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, you better watch out, because if the hood of Malik is true, then <laughs> maybe it's contagious. Oh, damn it! What? Did you mess up your tether? I screwed up my, uh, well, let me know. Well, I'll tell you one thing. I sure as heck can't mess up this. Ha oh. No, okay. All I have to do is uh. my hammer. Uh. Come here, Malak. Say hi to my hammer. Uh. That was a taste. My hammer ran out. Oh, and he's gone. He's getting away. He's getting away. Malak delays judgment. Ooh. Cannot escape it. Prey wants to run. We follow. Taken will hold his echo. Find it and find Malak. Huh. That's a rather short mission to start off. It was a very short mission. Mm -hmm. But there is more to do. There is more to do. As we so sit we here in the dreadnought I dancing. Think, I think the strike is next. The strike is next? I don't think I so. I think it is. I don't think so. There's probably there's got to be more set up. Nothing. All right, just go back to orbit and yeah, we'll has, see. There has to be more set up. Yeah, there has to be more set up. There's no way that it can just be that and then boom onto the strike. <laughs> nope. Not that easy. Not that easy. Gotta really hope that they have a strike exclusive helmet. Mm. I want to so, uh, head. Here, hold on. Let me uh, let me uh, mark what this. Is... Uh, is this the next one? Checking. Kill taken anywhere and find clues to where Malak is hiding. So okay. Kill taken anywhere. So we need to kill taken anywhere. If that's so the case, to, if that's the, the case, we, we could go to the dreadnought. Or in this case, hold on. Oh, okay. Hold on. In this case, we could uh. We could do the prison. We could. We but could. There's, but you know there's like three different versions of the prison now. There's regular and then there's taken. Here, let me look. Here, like let me uh, let me take a look. So, yeah, I yeah, see only the, two. The, uh, 
I see only two. I see the I see the forty one. Wait, what? Yeah, but yeah, but I saw that Bun Bungie said that there was a Takenified prison, and then there was, then there was the regular, and then there the, was the challenge. The Takenified prison is the regular one, Speed. That's the level really? forty-one version. That's the Takenified version. The Takenified version okay, and that go. normal one is all one. Okay, we can let's go hop in a prison. I haven't done prison in. So. All right. Yeah, we, I, none of us have. All right. So I'm going to stop the video here. I'll load back. This will this will be tomorrow's video of us doing the Prison of Elders. But I will see you guys in the next video. Don't forget to check out Speed's channel. Link's in the description below. And yeah, to the prison we go.